the anti-immigrant movement in this country is being used as a vehicle to further a white nationalist agenda. The very foundations of what we stand for, community, justice, and equality, are under attack. And our silence makes us complicit. Nearly 45 years ago, white supremacy as an explicit government policy was defeated as millions of Americans of all races and creeds joined forces to pass the Civil Rights Act of 1964, together with the Voting Rights and Immigration Reform Act of 1965. This legislation marked a turning point in the nation's history of racism and discrimination. Since 1965, we have seen a backlash in those civil rights advances. Today, these civil and human rights are being assaulted under the guise of anti-immigrant sentiment. Investigations by numerous civil rights groups conducted in the aftermath of the September terrorist attacks found that the anti-immigrant movement in this country is a well-organized network of front groups, all orchestrated by one man, John Tanton. John Tanton, who is an ophthalmologist from Michigan who came out of the Sierra Club, he believes the greatest danger to civilization is population growth. And he holds immigrants, specifically immigrants from Latin America and Africa, responsible for population growth. This is a guy who's a white nationalist. Each organization plays a crucial role within the Tanton network, allowing them to manipulate the immigration debate both politically and publicly. 